I went ahead and sectioned my hair. Guys, you see what I'm dealing with? Um, and I did try to blow dry it, but anyways, sectioned my hair. So I'm going to go ahead and just add some of the, my iron. So drop to the end. Yeah, I did apply oil when I was blow drying it. Um, Just massage, <laughs> and then I'm going to start. Okay. Okay. So the hair that I'll be pushing is this. It's pre-stretch. I purchased it off Amazon. Um, it says tore your stress. I'm wondering if that's a yes. So yes, this is tore your stress. Yeah. So I got this off Amazon. It is a pack. It is with a pair. It's a pack. So yeah. I'm going to start and see and have my cushion needle right here okay mm -hmm. yeah so let's put this here up um, so we can manage it better and I have my blow dryer right beside me just in case I need it cuz oh, let me show you And I have some shine and jam. And I also have this box, so just in case. So I'll see which one feels better for me. Since this is my first time breathing my own hair. So I just have to find what works. And then I'll know next time that, hey, that works. So you just stick to that one. Yeah. I will be crochet him. Um, I'll show you guys when I get closer to the front, but I'm just applying some of the shine and germ to my natural hair so it will blend better into my hair. Um, yeah, that's basically what I'm doing. I'm just twisting it to the end, trying to twist it as tight as possible because eventually it will have this puffy look, but here I'm just trying to twist it as tight as possible. The only thing that I regret is that I should have applied more shine and jam to my hair then that would have made it blend in better. But as I said, this is my first time building my own hair. So hey, it's a learning process, and, but it was fun as well. I'm trying to twist the hair all the way to the end because if you don't, when you hot water the hair, it will unwind. So ensure that you twist it all the way out so it holds better. So here, I'm pushing the cushion needle through my hair. First, then I'm applying the braid to it. And then I'm going to ensure that it's equal on both sides. So when I'm twisting, to the, twisting, I don't have to borrow from the other side. And as I said before, the only regret that I had was that I did not apply more shine and jam, jam to my hair. Then it would have blended the hair better. But yes, I'm just twisting it right here so you guys can see. What I'm doing and as I go along I apply more to the hair yes
something to show you guys again what I'm, I did. So I pushed the crochet needle through my hair and apply the braid in here. Ensure that it's oak or else it will not go through properly. I mean, my pull your hair, so I pull that through and ensure that it is equal on both sides since it's just one long hair. Um, and then I'm going to pull on my hair tincture side and apply some of the shine and jam to seal this. I can get my hair smooth and to blend in with the braiding hair since it's of a different texture. Yes, so. With this, it's all about the trials and tests, but eventually you get the hang of it, cause, and then when you're finished, you're like, "Ooh, I just did something amazing!" So yeah, just have fun while you're doing it, and just dedicate some time. Um, I don't remember exactly how long this took me, but it was worth it at the end. I would say. So the smile that you're going to see at the end is just me saying, oh my god, I just finished braiding my own hair for the first time. So yes, it was like, ha, ah, you did it. And if I can do it, you can do it too. So yes. So next. So after hot watering my hair and I dried it, I'm going to apply some of my silk drops to my roots just to keep it moist for the time being. If you have any other oil, you can basically use whatever oil you have at home just to apply it to your hair. Because even though you're doing a protective style, you're still supposed to, you know, moisture and ensure that it's moist properly and then what i'm going to go in with now is some mousse hair mousse it's from herbal so i'm going to do that and apply it to my hair so you can keep down any loose hair that is there yes it's a whole salon vibe for me okay <laughs> And now I'm just going to accessorize, you know, accessories makes everything looks 
bougie it looks better yes so i'm just applying some accessories that i picked up off amazon also you can go in there i can i'll leave a link below of the accessories that i got and also the braiding here okay So guys, I can officially say that this is a wrap. Uh, I am proud of my first attempt. It's not perfect, but I am proud of it nevertheless. Um, I had challenge when it comes down to parting. Like, I am trying to learn how to part my hair, but it's not working out. <laughs> Uh, yeah so for my first attempt it was cold i knew some of them might be smaller than some but that's okay i am proud um i used around almost three packs of the braid that i showed you guys so that's a good thing i can always try something else next time i'll know what to do different and all of those stuff so I, this is the first time I attempt something like this, so yes. Yeah. Anyway, thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Um, it was not the search tutorial, but it was just me showing you guys. Like, hey, you got it. You can do it if you put your mind to it, basically. So yeah.